Hey everyone, this is Nemo and in today's quick tip we will see how to enable file uploads for new tabs in the file manager of the PrestaShop back office. So this applies to PrestaShop 1.6.1 and newer only, but at the end of the video I will show you what to do in case you use an older version. So you might have given this for granted, but in PrestaShop you actually can't attach any file that is not an image or video with the standard adder. So if I now try to upload something like a PDF, well, I have to choose between image or video. Let's choose video here. So upload, I will choose my PDF and it seems it went through, but if I go back, you can see nothing. So this is really troublesome as you may have to attach documents or other files to your CMS pages. But fortunately, it's quite easy to overcome. So let's see how. I will close this up and I need to modify the file manager plugin. So what I'll do is I'll access my admin folder, file manager, and then the file presser shop uses is the minified version of plugin. So I don't want to use this since it's uh, a confused this way, so I will just rename my other plugin to plugin.main.js and I'll open this up. Now what I have to do is comment out these two lines here, so save. And this basically tells the system what type of element to display in the list. Two displays all types as its default, one displays images, and three displays videos. This also affects the behavior on click uh, on those uh, thumbnails, but this is something we should not really worry about too much. So again, let's test this out. So I'll refresh my page. And this is kind of a workaround, so I will add a video again. And you can see here my previously uploaded PDFs that now popped out. So I can try again, so drop files, and you can see there are four now. So great, it's been uploaded. Now, as I said, it's a workaround, so uh, it would be uselessly complicated to add new button to handle this and JavaScript things and, and so on. So I'll just pretend um, to be adding the video so that I can grab the link, which is what I'll do now. So I will click on a thumbnail, I will grab the link, Close this up and then add a normal link. So text to display, oops, a link to my PDF. Oops, PDF, not PSD. Okay, right, so link to my PDF. Great, well, it's not super smooth, but it's a lot better than having to access FTP every time just to upload a single file. Now. If you try to upload non-supported file types, uh, well, you can easily uh, add it by modifying config, config.php. If I scroll down, you'll see the allowed extensions. So you just have to uncomment these or simply add your own. Great, so we're done. Now, as I said before, this doesn't work on older PrestaShop versions, but if you use, uh, for example, 1.6.0.9, what you can do is take the 1.6.1 file manager folder and simply drop it over your old one and overwrite it or maybe change, uh, rename uh, the previous file manager folder so that the new one takes place. All right, we're done with this video. I hope you found it useful and if you did, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and check out the blog as well at nemops.com for more great videos and tuts about PrestaShop. Thanks for watching, I will see you next time.